if you know someone that's selling their, I'm sorry, y'all. If you know someone that's selling their property, but you need a indeed a deed. Okay, it's a private sale, so you're not really getting the real estate involved of it. Um, you can do this private. It's like a like a private um sale between you and the the you and the seller. So what y'all both do, y'all signing in a deed form. He's taking you taking ownership of the property, but you're not taking care of his mortgage. So all you have to pay is his property taxes and the water and the uh, watery water bill. And anything that's for the property tax, you want to ask when you do this. You want to ask how much he be. He or she is behind on their property taxes. Why? As a seller and a person that's buying the house, you want to see how far you can get and make arrangements with the state. In certain states, I think in all states, but in states, they behind a year. So right now, even though we're in 2022, you're paying out 2021. So they're always behind a year, even though you're a year afford it, if that makes sense to anybody. What that do with our notary, you would need a notary to get to, to in a case with that, it would need to be a notary involved of that. How that work is, that person sit down at the table or at the house, sell their properties, sign up all the, you sign all the paperwork, and a notary involved. There's a pri that's a private sale. No, you do not need a mortgage involved. No, you do not need a register involved. No, you don't need a lawyer. If it's the property, if it's offer a, a lawyer, then yes. But other than that, no. Um, no, you do not need any witness, but you just need that notary to sign off. On the meantime of all of that, it's between you and the seller signing off papers and you still ask your question. You still need to get um, an investor. A investor to look at the property, as in roof-wise. So you need to get a roof. Check the roof, check the plumbing, the water tank, the furnace. Even though you for do some remodel, you still need that. You want to know sure your the house is up to code. If it's the permits, or if um any dude, if you selling it like a house that needs to, it's been sitting there for a while. Them type of property houses with the landlord, you just want to get out the game because they he tired or behind or whatever, a lot of stuff. That's when a notary comes involved. Only reason because you know why you need a notary to sign to sign off of it, but you also it's a private sale. So by you buying the property for them, and no, you do not need a real estate agent involved. Only time you get a real estate involved is you need to get the tax paper. But the person who owns the house should give you that list. So if he or she will show you the whole list. Of what needs to be what needs to be wrong even though you can see some of what's going on with their property how many times they got citation of it it can be the garbage or it can be the plumbing if it can be the painting it can be the bricks is, is broke or it can be the the garbage got eaten up by the squirrels anything that's kind of petty wise the city would actually saute you that. It can be cutting grass also as sweets. By you binding it, that's what you for to deal with. But as a notary, we sign it off. So the notary is in and out and go. But the seller part, you bind it from it. So it's like more of a private sale niche. Trust me. I did four of them. You make up your own price. So if you do one to so sell price, they call you up and can you help us out to do blah 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 blah. Yes, my fee is one fifty. My fee is two hundred. Everybody charge their distance and wires. I just charge one flat rate, one twenty five. That's what I'm charging. So 
the seller can give you the 125 or the buyer can give you 125 trust me if you know somebody that about to sell that house doing a private sale trust me get that money get it get it get it um also too if this person kind of sell a lot of them get them your contact and set them can't keep calling to me because he was he or she trying to get out the game or just want to get in retirement to stay stable or can't be able to take care of the property anymore i will talk to y'all later bye bye